Good day viewers, welcome back to Prison Boy Shadow Blade. Regular Frank. Okay, continue that set up. Where were we? Where was it again? I completely forgot. I think my recording is a bit off today. Yes, it was off. Nagi was grimacing silently, but he raised his head in an instant. What's wrong, Nagi? Are you worried about your brother? You gonna visit him? Gonna take care of him, eh? Mitsuru grinned nastily as Enlo looked at Nagi. No! Don't be so don't be stubborn. You miss your brother, right? Hold your tongue. Well well, you should be honest. How about you, Tetsu? If I said yes, Nagi would be would would be su saltier. saltier. Please tell him to take good care of himself. Okay. <laughs> We finish supper and then I go back to my room with Nagi. Mitsuru so annoying. He said just quit to me. But what he say is kind of right. I remembered the the way people look at us. Toro is very like by never sin. like but never like this. People are fear in out of us. We exist to control the nation. But I can quit now. I'm never gonna rely on my parents. His family is a noble. He can be a Buricard if he if he hopes. But Naoya and Nagi aren't going to rely on the power of their family. You have strong mind. I'm encouraged by your words. By the way, how did you find the evidence they I told him what happened in Okawa's house briefly. Wow, that's great. A secret cabinet behind the painting. How could you find this? No, you help me. It's unfriendly of you to call him that way. When we are in this room, you can call him now as usual. <laughs> now? Now, that sounds like a girl's name. Yeah. Because you're our, you're our family. How come you got, you got a different name? Mm. Family. We are family. Nagi and no Oya are my family. But we aren't related by blood. Having lost my parents in an accident, I become an orphan when I was eight. And then Mr. Saiki took charge of me. I see. So Tetsu was adopted. Yeah. I don't remember around that time very much. They say I was depressed and wasn't able to speak much even I become a member of their family. However, Naoya and Nagi accepted me as a brother. I cannot thank them enough. I wonder if Nahu is okay. You know, he's all, almost never sick. Did he say anything when you were with him today? Nothing in particular. Nagi said, hmm, and then he tweeted. Don't you think he's been weird recently? How weird do you precisely mean? Is he weird? I don't think so. I don't think he's weird. I think it's quite fine. The Is way he? I'm not quite sure if it's quite fine or not. Don't think he's being weird recently. Weird? Like his mind is somewhere else and he's often in deep thought about something. As he said, I suddenly remembered. Yeah, he was a little weird when we read the letter we found. What that supposed to be? The rebel's letter? What was he like? He looked a bit strained and pale, like he couldn't hear my voice. See? It's weird of him to treat you, treat you that way. What's wrong with him? Yeah. 
Nagi looked down with a sad face. Should I have visited him? Well, it's too late for 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 regret. To change the topic, I slow I showed Nagi the box Naoya gave it to me. By the way, Naoya gave this to me today. Yeah, it's it's not, yeah, it's not your birthday or anything, right? No, he said this is a gift for my entrance in, into Toko. A metallic seal, sir. Normally seals are made of wood, resins or horns, right? Yeah, I couldn't ask him what it, what is it. Hmm. Well, just keep it. It doesn't look new anyway. Oh, I remember now. He gave me something too. Nagi took something out of his pocket and showed it to me. A clock? A watch? Yeah. Wow, it's cool. The watch has an elaborate decor and was really beautiful. Looking at it closely, I found their sacred family emblem in the back. It means it's a special ordered watch. Hey, they look like parting gifts. I think they are. But Nagi is making a sour face. What's wrong? It's nice. It's a nice watch. Something's wrong here. It's like they give you, they give you parting gifts. I think so too, eh? Yeah, I was happy, but. Nagi brought the watch to my ear. Silent. What? It's not working? Bingo. It's broken. So oh. for a parting gift. Why would Noya give you give a broken gift? Yeah. It's not even working. What's up with that? Did, did you wind it up? Of course I did. But it just doesn't work. I complained to him about giving me a broken watch, but he was like, maybe it'll help you one day. I don't know what he what he thinks. Help you one day with a broken watch? Maybe there's something inside. Hmm, it doesn't sound much like like him. You think so too, right? It's a bit strange. I look at the two items and try to see what they really mean. But I couldn't understand at all. Ah, I shouldn't visit I shouldn't visit him tonight. I guess our bro our brother doesn't feel comfortable with having Mitsuri in the same room. They're good friends, don't worry. Hmm, I don't get it. I don't know why they get along with Maybe they have a past that we don't know. Truly. I don't favor him much, but I think he was a serious exemplary student in school. Nagi always wonder why Naoya gets along with Mitsuru because Mitsuru is a little flippant. flippant. You're too harsh on Mitsuru. Just try to be with him with him all 24 hours. You'd feel like you wanna punch him. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you're just a hot-headed person. I'll hold back. I'd like to have have my brother as my partner. That's it. Can I take your place? No. <laughs> <laughs> that was a quick answer. <laughs> we should joke and laugh as as always. What's your mission for tomorrow, Detsu? We're going to go go for a look around at Asakusa. Rebels can be everywhere. We have to check if there are any suspicious people in prediction of course of cops patrolling the street is also an important mission that's great it's fun to walk around nakamisi street as senyuji temple asakusa is thriving as a amusement area and senyuji temple is a place where people relay or re religiously is something called Asakusa Temple by the locals. There's a shopping street called Nakashima from the gate in K 
canon do it the princess of Sensho G temple people enjoy buying souvenirs in famous convention walking around Asakusa is one of the amusements I smile bitter fly bitterly bitterly it's a mission we can have 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 much have fun much what's yours I have to clean bathrooms in the early morning it's funner for today's failure <laughs> oh okay well Mitsuru has to do it as well that serves him right along with you Nagi Green but I imagine that Mitsuru would push his work onto Nagi. I think Mitsuru doesn't even want to work. What? He, is he gonna slack off or something? I think he's gonna slack off. Like what some people usually do. Next morning, August 23. When I got out of bed, Nagi had already gone. Well, early in the morning, Nagi said, True. He needs to clean the bathroom as a punishment for failing to drag information out of the suspect. Probably he is gambling and rubbing the toilet with a brush now. I got dressed and headed to the entrance in the first basement. Is Naoya still there? He says he's acting weird. Is he still sleeping? Maybe. Seeing an other officer going their mission, I was waiting for Naoya. But he didn't come to the meeting place at the appointed time. Hmm? He's late? This is the first time he's late for an appointment? Since he was sick last, na last night, perhaps he's still in, in, ill in bed. I headed to Naoya's place room, 318. I knock on the door. Knock knock. Good morning, Naoya. Are you there? Nobody answered. I knock again. Knock, 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 knock. Naoya, it's me, Tetsu. Is there anything wrong? No one answered. Is he still sleeping? I feel anxious and reach for the doorknob. I can't, I can't. Can I open the door? I twisted the knob, but it's locked. It was locked. Perhaps this con condition took a sudden turn for the worse. Mitsuru said that Naoya looked sick last night. It would be serious if he fatal condition alone in the room, but I cannot open the door now. Mitsuru has the key. I ran toward Mitsuru and Nagi. On the way to the, the bathroom, I ran into Mitsuru. Mitsu Mitsuru! Hi Tetsu, what happened? Tetsu, you Tetsu. look... You look pale. Well, Naoya didn't come out of the entrance at the appointed time. And, and then, when I went to his room, I called him, but there's no answer. You said Naoya looked sick last night, didn't you? He might be lying unconscious on the floor. Can you unlock the door? Misuru instantly turned pale. Okay, let's go right now. I'll go with you. I got back in front of the room 3318. Mr. Ru unlocked the door. Naoya, are you there? Three. Where's Naoya? When we opened the door. What? Did he hang himself? Naoya was hanging himself? He's dead! What happened? He hang himself? It's suicide? Why would Naoya do that? Yeah. There's no suspect. Naoya, what? Naoya! I couldn't understand what was happening. Naoya! Wait, don't touch anything! What are you saying? Then, let, let me go. No, you, no, you. Nagi was trying to get close, closer to Naoya, but Mitsuru stopped him. On the opposite side of the room, 
Nooya was dangling from from the rope. No. What's happening? Why? Nooya is hanging himself? It's to get your hands off me! Bro! Run and get the medic! Tetsunagi, you need to! Misuru direct direction and Nagi scream echoes in my head. I don't really remember what was going on after that. I did a stall but I was feeling like my arms and leg and my mouth weren't mine. The next day, the funeral for the eldest son of Seiki was performed in solemn atmosphere. After the funeral, Nagi and I had to wait in the locker room. Lock room. Rock, lock room. We couldn't accept Naoya's death. We was always next to me. And he was always kind, but he's gone. Since it happened so suddenly, we weren't able to find the world, the word each other, and kept being silent in the quiet room. Misuru had to be ex examined by Jero Kungo because he was Naoya's roommate. Naoya hang himself, so all the co concerned people, including us, were gag ordered to say nothing regarding the incident. But people will talk. Although I don't, I didn't tell anybody anything. The exaggerated rumor with del delusion soon spread through 12-story prison. Why did Naoya kill himself? That's the main problem. Why did he kill himself? Uh... Oh. Tetsu Akatsuki. Yes, sir. What about Nagi Saeki? I told both of you to come together, didn't I? I'm sorry, but Nagi was being deeply distressed by his brother's death. Nagi was terribly depressed after Naoya's death and refuses to leave the room. You can have such a feeble spirit to a Toko officer. Well, that's okay. Tetsu Akatsuki, I'll ask you about Naoya's sake is death. You really weren't concerned yourself with Naoya's sake is dead, were you? I looked directly to Jero Kongra's eyes and said, no. Jero Kongra looked back at me sharply. Being started with these di dignified sharp eyes, I got goosebumps all over my body. I knew I needed to endure the fear. Jero Kongra kept staring at me for a while and said, Okay, I trust your eyes. I'll tell you the survey results later. We conclude that all you say is dead was a suicide. Suicide? Yes, we couldn't find anything, any injuries or drug reaction in his body. So you are free now. Yes, sir. But still we have, we have to do a personal arrangement. The Seiki family has a powerful effect on the Metropolitan Police Department. The upper management has been busy to handle this case. You guys just go on city, city survey and so on. Are you clear? Yes, sir. I saluted Jerofugo but I hesitated to leave the room because I had an important question. Sir, what will happen to Mitsuru? Jero Kongo seemed to know that I wonder would I ask about it and answer clearly. There's more questions I need to ask Mitsuru Fua. Tell Nagiseki that it will take a while for his returning. Yes, sir. You may go now. Thank you, sir. So it was a suicide. So no one killed him? A city survey. Well, it's a good radiance for them. I was, I was one wa worried about Nagi. I decided to go back to room three three zero. Whoa. Okay. I will just go to this next part. Whoa. I didn't. I didn't manage to. 
I, didn't, I wasn't expecting to see a uh, murder in this game. I thought this guy would be killing rebels, but this one's different. I didn't expect anything for a suicide. I mean, I never expected a suicide to begin with. It's not, I think it's not. Well, the general said didn't find any any drug in him. But he, but what about fingerprints? Well, true. They need to do that on fingerprints. They need, they can do that. They're police themselves. So okay, we'll go to you. And I wish Naoya is didn't suicide himself. We're gonna find out. I think we'll continue the story. So, uh, shout out to the director. We'll go to the next part. See you next part, guys. See ya.